This tutorial is on how to use our new resume search as a company or a property recruiter. Resume search option will now appear on the left menu. We recommend to start your search with wide parameters such as job title, experience, and location. If you see too many results, then you can start narrowing your results by adding additional filters. Here's a quick example on how to use the new search. Here we'll be looking at resumes for general manager position. To search, we'll first enter the job title in the job title filter. For this example, we will enter general manager position. And to find resumes that currently hold the general manager position, we'll toggle is current on. Next, we will select the experience required for this field. We will choose a minimum of five and a maximum of 20 years of experience and a total of one to five years of management experience. Finally, we will enter our desired location and distance from the municipality or city this position is for. In this example, we're searching 50 miles from New York, from New York State. Note here municipality is equivalent to a city and the region is to state. Now we will click search to view the results. With the current filters, we found a total of 15 results. Here we'll see the latest job title the candidate has and the total years of experience they have stated in their resume. Industry and doc ID can be ignored as they're irrelevant. To view the candidate's resume, click on View Resume. On the left, you will see the resumes grouped into relevant sections, such as employment history, education history, any skills they have acquired in each of their positions, and achievement and honors stated in their resume. On the right hand side, you'll see a depersonalized version of the resume as uploaded by the candidate. To view the next resume, click on Next. And to download a PDF version of the resume to get the contact details, click on Actions and Download. To further refine your search, we recommend using any combination of the following filters. Many of these filters check if the information is entered in the resume itself. Most of the information is not mandatory, so it can easily be omitted by the job seeker. These filters are skills, Boolean or semantic search, spoken languages, certification, education, employers, and document data. Document metadata allows you to filter resumes by last modified date. For example, you're able to search resumes that have been modified in the last six months. We do advise not to use the following filters to refine your search. Industries, as it's inconsistent within the hospitality industry, executives, document language within the document mesh data filter, and uncommon filters. Here is an example of how to use some of the more advanced filters to refine your search. For an accountant position that requires a CPA certification and is located in Florida, for which we get a total of 20 results, with all candidates that have a CPA certification. Here is the last example on how to use the advanced filters. Here we're searching for a housekeeper that speaks Spanish and is located within 50 miles of New York City in New York State. Here we have 35 candidates that speak Spanish and have listed housekeeping experience in their resume. Thank you.